We love this next guy, Sam Smith. He's in the middle of his In the Lonely Hour North American tour. And this young lady got to catch up with him before a recent concert in Dallas. Yeah, we really love him. He's amazing. He has a lot of reason to celebrate. So I got to sit down with the Grammy winner to talk about his voice, his weight, and the exciting news that he's now sharing with us for the first time. Sam Smith has been the voice of pop music for nearly the past two years, topping the chart. But this summer, that iconic voice has been silenced due to a serious vocal cord injury, forcing him to cancel more than a dozen concerts. But now he's back. It's been a struggle to get through. I've had to reschedule some of the shows because mm -hmm. I've got to plan uh, longer resting breaks in between shows. And now your, your pipes are all good? Pipes are good. Yeah. You're hitting those falsettos still? <laughs> yeah. It's rest? good. It, it, it's all feeling good. But I just need to stop writing songs that are too high <laughs> to sing. <laughs> <laughs> you also look amazing. Thank you. He also recently shed nearly 50 pounds and admits it hasn't been easy. You're on a nutrition kick. Yeah, it's not a diet. It's not a diet. My relationship with food has just completely changed. During the process of this album, I just I was getting bigger and bigger and bigger. Well, I know during your childhood, you, you said that you were teased for being gay and for being overweight, but you said the being overweight part was what really hurt. When someone calls you gay, there's not much you can do about that, because I am. Um, whereas if someone calls you fat, there is something you can do about that. Was it an emotional attachment to food then? Oh, massively, yeah. Because I love food yeah. so much. I like went to bed last night dreaming of tuna melts. <laughs> I love food. Is that your thing, tuna melt? Yeah, tuna melt <laughs> with crisps. With the crisps and the, the potato yeah. chips in the inside? No, no, on the side. Oh, yeah. I mean, my record is called In the Lonely Hour. I ate my way through. <laughs> Through the process. Lonely no more, that signature soulful falsetto has earned him yet another honor, which he's revealing for the first time today. Do we need some theme music to build up no, for this? I'm, I'm doing Bond. I'm doing the theme, theme tune to Bond. A year ago, people were just discovering who you were, and now you are writing the music to the James Bond theme song. That's incredible. Which, yeah, it, it's, even saying it now, it feels, it feels very weird to me to be able to do wow. it. It's been a dream of mine for a long, long time. A dream come true, writing and recording the coveted theme song to the new James Bond film, Spectre. I know it's super, super top secret, but can you tell us a little bit about um, I can tell you how it fits the film? I just wanted to write a love song, something classic yeah. and um, timeless. And you were a little coy with it because you denied reports. You're like, ah, nothing to do with it, right? Yeah, I think, yeah, I tried my best. <laughs> you, you were doing your ultimate James Bond yourself. I, yeah, I, tr I tried my absolute best. I think if you look at some of the videos, by the way, you can see I'm a very good liar. <laughs> but his music is honest, soulful, and raw, and continues to top Billboard charts around the globe, selling 14 million singles in the U.S. alone. What do you think it is about your music that's resonating? I've decided not to even think about it. I can't even think about it, because that's when the music's going to lose its soul. And maybe that is the key, so. And Sam Smith hard at work on his second album, which he says it's going to be broader and even more honest than the first. The, the first was so honest as, as was. And Spectre opens November 6th, so I imagine we're going to, we're going to start to hear his song hopefully soon in the coming weeks. Hello today, fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.